Okay, let's do a reset for this uh, cricket wave phone. Um, the phone must be powered off and remove external web memory card to save some files. Uh, okay, because everything is going to be deleted on this phone's memory, like pictures, videos, contacts, messages, emails, and passwords. Okay, so and it is very important that you know your Google account because after the factory reset, you will have to confirm Google account. If you fail to do that, then you won't be able to get to the home screen so it is very important that you know your Google if you know the email address just go to a computer and reset the password in order to continue okay if you're ready you're gonna start using volume up and power key you wanna press these two buttons together and as soon as the phone vibrates or uh, any logo appears uh, release power button continue holding volume up okay then uh, when you see a recovery menu, just release the volume up. Okay, ready? Volume up, power. Phone vibrates, release power key. Continue volume, volume up. Okay, right there. Release volume up. Okay, now we're gonna use volume down to scroll. We're gonna highlight or select wipe data factory reset. Okay, the option. Now press power key to confirm. Uh, last step is uh, using volume down and to confirm that we went through already, everything is going to be deleted on your phone. And just uh, press power key. And your phone is wiping data. Now last step is uh, reboot system now automatically highlighted. Just press power key to confirm and your phone will reboot at this point okay so okay so it takes longer than uh, five to eight minutes in this android logo or cricket logo i just remove the battery wait five seconds we put it back in and start over again with the same process volume up and power key Also, if your phone um, you get you lost signal a lot, or your phone just uh, go off when you are using it, or you experience a lot of drop calls, this uh, process helps a lot to calibrate the motherboard. But uh, the first time you need to know your Google account, make sure you know, know everything, and you did, you did a backup or yeah, um, copy your data on your Google account in order to save files. Okay. All right, so we're gonna initial setup. English is automatically highlighted. Uh, select, let's go. Now skip this step. Set up some new phone or copy your data. If you want to use the same Google account, just copy your data or set up as a new phone. And at this point, you can go ahead and insert your activate, active ticket uh, SIM card in order to get data. To confirm Google or just connect to any Wi-Fi, but for now I'm just gonna create no data, no at all. Just um, okay. Select your time zone and date to switch the month. Just go ahead this arrow and select the day. Now hit OK when you are ready. Time. This is the hour. Uh, to set the minutes, talks there, minutes, a.m. or p.m. and hit OK. When you're ready, go next. <clears throat> Nickname for your phone in case uh, you lost your phone and they guess your lock screen. Uh, they're gonna have to verify the nickname of the phone in order to continue. So if they fail to confirm nickname, they won't be able to use your phone and access to your information so it is important that you select that okay go next pattern pin a password not now you can do this later run phones menu google services i r suggest to leave everything on so you can take advantage of all the um, google services agree uh, you can add an, a second gmail account 
all set location consent next and cricket terms and conditions just touch i agree and it's all set okay we are in home screen thanks so much for choosing my video please subscribe so you can have access to my other tutorials about this phone or any other model that you may need help with okay thanks so much